I was so excited to hear that I was going to meet Viggo Mortensen. So I was like, are you kidding me? This is amazing. So I was very, very excited. And what was he like? Well, he was kind of shy at first, but after you get to know him, he was very nice. He's wicked. He's wicked. He's um, he's just such a, a gentle guy. And obviously, he's so so experienced. He was he was always very always very giving, but never sort of like you know forthcoming. Like it should be like this, should be like that. He just sort of led by example. I play Kidin Nai, who is a nudist. A little weird, but he likes to wear a whale suit. They had to make this whole big whale suit costume. What was it like wearing it? It. Well, it, was, it had like barnacles all over. It was just like it was all blue, and it had barnacles and, like, and a tail. So. Oh my gosh! So yeah. you didn't have to go nude the whole time. Um, not really. No, yeah. that's good. So tell us about your character in the film. Um, my name is Zaja. I'm Vigo's daughter. I live in the woods with the rest of my siblings. I'm really intelligent, but I'm really dark and kind of weird. I do like taxidermy. I play Keeler Cash, and so she's the second oldest. She's a twin, and my, I play fraternal twin. She's very just curious, kind of about the real world as well. So as this family is emerging into the real world and assimilating into like society, she's very interested in that. Vesper is... She's a, a super strong woman, I would say. I wouldn't really describe her as a girl just because of what she's gone through and she's she can survive in the wilderness on her own and not very many teenagers can say that. So George McKay's role is this young guy. Obviously, you know, he's grown up in the woods. He hasn't had any influences from the outside world and when you grow up like that you're kind of free from being influenced by people socially so he's like a young guy and I'm the first girl that he meets and has a romantic interaction with and a flirtation with. Are you the oldest of the kids in the family? Yeah, yeah, I'm the oldest of the, I'm the, oldest of the wee ones, yeah. yeah. <laughs> How was that, having this big family of siblings on uh, the it was, it was amazing. It was really, really wonderful. We, uh, yeah, we all became a real family and yeah, the, the guys are just, they're all amazing. Did you get along with all the rest of the kids? Yeah, yeah, we all basically became really close during the film and we became a family and that was, I feel like that's really rare, especially in this industry. I'm an only child. But now I'm not because of the movie. In the movie, um, I, who played my little brother, um, my dad and his mom are now boyfriend and girlfriend and we all live together. And so now I have, like, I'm not an only child anymore. It was one of the best experiences of my life. Really? Yeah. It was the first movie I ever did and I made so many friends and I learned so much. He's the best director I've ever worked with and he trusted six kids with these huge parts, these huge roles, and he, get, he made children smart, which a lot of people don't like to do. We're really intelligent and strong in this movie and I, and he gave parts like that to six and nine year old kids and I just, I'm, I'm very thankful for that. I think that's cool.